been with day two of my C twenty five journey. So, uh, I apologize for yesterday's long, lengthy video. This one's gonna be short, sweet, and to the point. Um, I got speed one point oh. I remember loving this workout. So because I said that, I'm sure it's gonna be challenging. I'm gonna fall on the floor and not be able to do it. All sorts of crazy stuff. But I'm just gonna pretend and keep the positive mindset that I'm gonna love it. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be awesome. And I'll talk to you guys at the end. Focus. Oh, I want you to put the energy and focus on the obliques. Come on. Any obliques? Okay, here we go. Four more. And three. Got it. Come on. Keep up the work. Push. Keep going. Push. Turn it low. Here we go. Push. And hit. One more time. Here we go. Yep. Here we go. Speed 1.0, and I was right. It was my favorite workout. I remember now. Um, I wasn't sure. I couldn't remember exactly what the workout was, but I knew I loved this workout. Um, I remember actually the first week hating it, kind of, because I was uncoordinated and I couldn't do it. And I was like, what the heck is he doing with the fountain and the thing? And he's on some beat, and I'm not on a beat at all. So like, I was very frustrated the first week I tried this program. But then as I got going in it, loved this workout, and I remembered why. Um, it's so much fun. Because it's the way I like to train personally, where I get to go one minute full speed, like as much as I can do. And then I know I'm going to get a stretch um, in the next minute. So I really like that way that he breaks that up. So you'll do like a, basically like a jog, sprint, like hit drill kind of thing. And then you'll do like a quad stretch. And then you'll do like um, another really high intensity thing. And then you'll do like a, whatever, like a, um, I don't know, chest stretch. Like you do all the stretches in between. And then at the end, you combine all of the one minute fast paced things you did in the burnout. So you do them all again at the end, all the way through with no stretching in between. But I just like the pace of that. It makes the workout move much faster. It's a lot of fun. Um, my numbers are pretty awesome today. Um, I got 314 calories um, in 25 minutes. So that was more than I did yesterday in cardio. And I was trying to figure out why, because you do slow down a little bit here, but I probably took less breaks. I was having more fun. I was getting into it. Um, I was, my max heart rate was up at 194, so I still pushed and hit really, really, like, you know, intense workouts, but then the average was 168. So it's because you stopped and did the stretching and paced myself, so it kind of brought the average down, which is, you know, better. You should not be at 194 your whole workout, but bad. But it still shows that I was able to get intense in those bursts of, um, of activity and then to, to slow it back down. So that's kind of, kind of cool. And then I don't really know what this part means, but it says that I was in the fitness zone for 27 minutes um, and the fat burning zone for like 50 seconds. I don't know what it means, but it's there, so I'm telling you what it is. But overall, it was a good workout. I really enjoyed this one. Happy I got to get it in today. So excited. Um, again, leave comments. Let me know you're watching. Let me know if you have questions. If you want to get started in my challenge group, I'll see you guys tomorrow for day three of C25. Bye, guys. <laughs>